Hey everybody, what's happening? We're here at Oticon. We're talking with Josh, the creator of Maximum Muscle Hustle Protein Supreme. Maximum Muscle Hustle Protein Supreme. And Ichabod Crane. That's more of a team effort. So like, the director of that game, Taro Mia, he sadly can't be here right now, but I'm here representing it for him. So. Let's start with that one. Gage, you played this one, what did you think? Yeah, so, where did a lot of inspiration for this game come from? Because I've played you know, quite a few puzzle games, and my, one of my favorites is Portal 2, and this game felt like it had a Portal 2 kind of feeling to it so far. So like, where, what kind of drove you guys to make this puzzle? Like, well, okay, so like, this game was originally developed at uh, the Global Game Jam in 2014, the initial demo of it. And uh, the theme was, I um, can't remember what the theme was specifically, but it was sort of like, uh, you gotta use different perspectives. And so like, Taro had the brilliant idea of a game where you have like a second person perspective. And we sort of just developed it from there, where you play as a, a robot called uh, Ichabod Crane, and uh, you control your head and your body separately. And so we just sort of took it then from there, we're continuing to develop it, work on it, and uh, explore new ways to work with the, uh, with the head throwing mechanic. And uh, definitely like Portal and other sort of puzzle adventures like that were a big influence on us. Cool, and I guess we should probably tell people what the game is actually. So what, give us your little elevator speech on what Ichabod Crane really is. So you play as the horseless, headless horse bot, Ichabod Crane, who's trying to escape from the, an evil space dungeon. And the horseless, headless horse bot core is uh, chasing him down. So, you know, you gotta use your head to solve mind bending puzzles. Literally, literally use mind your head. Mind bending. Just be sure not to lose your head. <laughs> now, you said this was an early build. How far in development are you guys? Uh, we're, uh, we're like, this is like an alpha build. Same thing with Muscle Hustle over here, alpha builds. We're sort of bringing these to conventions to sort of like get uh, some good play testing in, feedback in, uh, make these into the best games we can possibly make. Gadget, you will? You want to talk about Muscle Ichab Hustle? Ichabod, was it just on PC? Or? Uh, it is on uh, PC, but it's also playable online, so you can like uh, play it in the browser if you have the Unity uh, Web Player plugin. And it's actually on uh, www.ichabodcrane.com. Okay, write that down. Okay. Also, you can also find it on uh, omiagames.com. Uh and uh, check out some of Taro's other games. They're really, really great. Okay, now let's talk about Maximum Muscle Hustle Protein Supreme. Obviously a genius name. Yep, it was, uh, so Maxim Muscle Hustle was an idea I've been throwing around for like a while now, but I've actually recently begun active development on. So it's like, it started with an idea I had about, you know, like games, like a game where, you know, a sort of like running game where you, instead of like, you know, using like action moves, everything's just lifting and growing. So, um, and Maxim Muscle Hustle, uh, like what, what better type of character to, to work with than like a, a bodybuilder? So uh, yeah, Maximum Muscle Hustle Protein Supreme. It's like this uh, sort of constantly moving. I don't want to call it like an infinite runner since um, the levels are designed and not procedurally generated. Sort of like, um, so I guess you could call it a runner, but um, it's- uh, Kind of like a Sonic game? Or? Kind of like, yeah, kind of like that. Like uh, this game, um, this game's like my tribute to like old school, like 16-bit Sega Genesis games like that. Took a lot of uh, inspiration from like uh, Treasure LTD games, like uh, Gunstar Heroes and Dynamite Heady. Excellent. Yeah, great, great old school game. So there's bosses at the end of the levels, all that kind of Oh yeah, definitely. There's gonna be, um, planning about eight levels right now. So uh, there's gonna be bosses at the end of each level and uh, there's gonna be branching paths. That's another thing in the, in the plan, so. Very cool, well it's looking good. Um, any kind of idea of release date or? Um, I want to shoot for about next year. Uh, of course, it ultimately depends. Anything could be up in the air. But right now, I'm thinking about next year. And, and which platforms will that be on? Uh, PC first. And then I'm going to see if I can uh, port it to mobile and uh, possibly try and get it on the consoles as well. Excellent. Nice. Well, it's a lot of fun. I was watching Nine play it. Uh, you should be very proud of, of the games here. It's looking really good. Thanks. I hope you guys have a great Oticon. Uh, absolutely. absolutely. <laughs> All right. See ya.